Hello friends, in this video we are going to find the output waveform of the XOR gate and XNOR gate, okay, when the inputs are given in waveform form, okay, and we can also, uh, after getting the output waveform of XOR gate and XNOR gate, we will check, we can check whether it is a complement of each other or not, we can see this one also, so let's uh, start doing this one, it's quite interesting, so, So I have already uh, drawn the XOR uh, truth table of the XOR gate and XNOR gate, okay, and uh, mm, we will consider it that uh, this is our uh, this is our output Y and this is our Y uh, X, okay. So XOR gate is giving you X output and XNOR gate is giving you Y output. So let's do it X and Y. We will do it like this so it's better to draw a pattern between truth table okay so this is XOR truth table so here you can see okay when both the inputs are same means 0 0 then only you are getting 0 okay when both the inputs are same means 0 0 and 1 1 you are getting 0 when inputs are different you are getting 1 okay for XOR gate when inputs are same the output is 0 when inputs are different the output is 1 so let's do it. So A is 0 and B is 0. Okay. So 0, 0. So this will make 0. This will be 0. Okay. Now here A is 1 and B is 0. Okay. So what this will make? This will make 1. Now 1, 1. So 1 1 a is 1 b is 1 so this will give you output 0 sorry guys my drawing is not very good okay now a is 0 and b is 1 okay so different so it will give you output 1 now again 0 and 0 you are getting 0 0 so this output will become 0 now 1 0 a is 1 b is 0 so this output will give you 1 0 will give you 1 when it, because inputs are different now 0 1 0 1 will give you again 1 and 0 0 will give you 0 so make it 0 so this is your x okay guys now let's draw for xor xnor gate sorry this is the xnor gate so here you can see when both the inputs are same when both the inputs are same then only you are getting one and both, both the inputs are different you are getting zero so see inputs are same so it will start with one one zero inputs are different so output will become zero one one will give you one zero one will give you zero Again, 0, 0 is same, so you will get output 1. 1, 0 is different, so you will get output. 1, 0 is different, you will get output 0. Again, this is 0, 1. This was 0 and this is 1. Different output, so you will get 0 again. Now, 0, 0, both the outputs are same, so this will again become 1. So now you can also verify that x and y are complement of it, of each other so we can say then x nor is the complement of the xor and we already drawn the uh, output waveform of the x nor gate and x or gate so guys i hope you like the video please like and subscribe my channel thank you for watching